Hey guys, it's Lux, and welcome back to my channel, and welcome to my first video of 2022. My first voiceover of 2022, my first voiceover in a while, it's gonna be a little awkward anyways. Hi, I'm doing a speed build. Um, I'm doing a base game, starter home, two bedroom, one bathroom build, super simple. But yeah, I just want to do super, like a super simple build to kind of start my speed builds this year and um yeah i didn't at first think this was going to be a um starter house so i intended on having a basement and basements are um quite expensive if you build um on a budget enough and you notice um so i ended up getting rid of it which is funny because i spent a bunch of time fiddling with the stairs and the back which i just kept in just to kind of show you what i was going to do and i thought maybe it kind of make the base game uh starter work with the basement but now it just ended up being too expensive so i just kind of put a kibosh on that idea but um yeah it's uh you know super simple build not much to talk about i'm sure i'll mention little things as i go along but really i just wanted to kind of talk about um the new year because it's a it's a slow start for me i really wanted to have videos ready for the new year and like start uploading consistently and start filming new ones as the ones i've pre-filmed upload of uh, the first month but that never happened <laughs> um the time right before matt came to visit which is when i was gonna have my vacation or when i did have my vacation where i didn't touch social media at all really um i planned on um recording before that but i kind of get a little sick so i just decided not to and decided to take it easy and um yeah i think that's gonna be most beneficial for me i think stop trying or me stopping to try and like i don't know please uh, people who i don't really need to be pleasing is kind of stupid i don't know when this is a hobby that i'm just doing by myself there's no need for me to stress out about it i don't want it to be a fun experience but i do want to turn it into something not bigger than being a hobby like i or not like i don't know i don't know i just want to keep doing this you know and i want to be more consistent with it because it does feel good to be consistent with things especially with little hobbies like this so yeah i did a little bit of um debug item um grabbing for the landscape uh, I did a backyard, but I didn't really add anything in the backyard because it was over budget. Because I kind of got a little overzealous on the inside. Like, I started, um, adding- by the way, you're gonna see me fiddle around with this for a little bit. Um, but yeah, I started, um, kind of going a little crazy on the kitchen. And, um, you know, um, all the cabinets. And I was going, like, way over my budget, so I had to kind of just- stop myself and say okay let's delete a couple of these counters so i can actually get all of the amenities that i need in this house <laughs> um but yeah of course if you want um this build in your game at all um all of my gallery id things are in the description you can see what this house is called in the gallery and what my name is and all of that but um yeah i also used some of this grass that was in debug and i like it i'm kind of liking it and i like the two different shades that there are kind of fun the landscaping on this one isn't my favorite i really like the moss or not the moss the like vines i have at the top uh right of the house that you or right of the screen that you can see those things um hanging off of the side i really really like that i think they look super super nice um it's just small little decal i don't know i didn't want to go for anything too extravagant with this house i wanted to build some houses just for people to like throw in their games and not worry about like them being too nicely decorated like a starter house or just kind of a clean-ish slate i don't want too much clutter in some of the houses i'm going to be making this year because i want to make some super affordable base game houses that'll mostly be focusing on the architecture of the houses because i want to do a lot of architecture things this year the interior designing i'm going to save for some commercial lots i'm building this year because um the architecture in commercial lots is a lot different than houses there's a lot less little intricacies i mean there can be more intricacies but a lot of commercial lots end up having either a modern flair or just a box um <laughs> so it's not that bad it's more like the inside i really like about commercial lots the outsides can you know have to look nice too but those are fairly i don't know easier to make look nice i feel like more than houses that's just me though but i wanted to do a lot of commercial builds this year and um the thing is they take a while because i'm very i can't sit down um for too long and i take a lot of breaks and then i feel all discombobulated um but yeah, I still am really, like, into finishing these builds. And yeah, this at this point I realized, like, oh, this basement's kind of going to suck for this little thing I have going on here. Because I have, um, 
foundation under the house um and yeah just ignore me going through these stairs just yep <laughs> there we go there we go we're actually we got rid of the basement oh <laughs> we're going in putting some doors up um but yeah so yeah not super decorated at all but hey that's okay but um <clears throat> back to commercial lots i've been working on like a cafe and it's like it's a beast it's a beast of a cafe like there's oh my god there's so many like little wall decals everywhere and there's so many tiny little details i want to add and i want to make it like accurate too go and have all the room for like the storage and all the room for like in between the walls for like pipes and stuff that need to go through like i want to make it like quite realistic i want like a storage room i want like empty space above it um that could be you know rented out you know in that kind of like urban setting kind of um you know what i mean <laughs> You know what I mean? Like how on some like streets you got some um, businesses and then um, apartments over top. I want to make a lot of builds like those. those. Those are so fun. I was building a street block last year that I kind of never uh, finished. I might finish it though this year because um, I have slowly been working on it. I just probably won't make a full video on it because it's, you know, like I said, a really slow work in progress. But that thing is so, I love it. I love it so much. I love that project. And I think it's a really, um, cool thing that i'm probably i might share in like a little um tour not mm, like a speed build obviously i can't do a speed build because um i haven't recorded my, mm, bleh, most of my building i'm sorry i'm starting to ramble a lot um as i do this deep in my voiceovers because i've kind of found my stride and what i'm talking about and now i'm like okay i gotta talk about every single little thing at once and i get all all over the place so um everything i end up talking about ends up being incohesive <laughs> um yeah this is where i went a little too crazy i wasn't looking at my budget i was just adding adding stuff and i didn't really need to but yeah i eventually deleted some extra cabinets i didn't need so i could actually get all the utilities i believe all of the basic utilities like i have a garbage obviously i have sink stove uh, bathroom amenities uh both of the um bedrooms have a like a dresser and end tables and there's a little extra room that like if you have packs and stuff and you have dogs or whatever and you need to throw like something in like a quick laundry room or whatever um there's a tiny like little closet that i just i think i threw the trash can in it but you can turn it into whatever you want it was meant to be like a little pantry thing but yeah you can throw a laundry room in there or another bathroom whatever you want it's kind of just free open space <laughs> that you can that people can, I don't know if you're, I don't know, okay, now I'm talking to a direct person, <laughs> that's kind of weird, I don't mean to single people out, but yeah, if anyone wants to use this house, there's a nice little extra room, okay, but um, yeah, that's really all I gotta say, sorry for being so out of breath, I'm just really excited to record voiceovers again, and I can hear myself wheezing, because <laughs> I'm talking so fast, but anyways, yeah, thank you guys for watching this video, and um, yeah, I will see you all in the next video of whatever I make. Thanks, bye.